Hi, I'm Teniola Shoboale. Here's your Channels TV Evening News Recap for January the 9th, 2021. A federal high court sitting in Abuja has dismissed the alleged certificate forgery suit filed against the governor of Edo State, Godwin Obaseki. Justice Ahmed Mohammed dismissed the suit filed by the All Progressives Congress and chieftain of the party, Williams Edwo, against the governor in a judgment delivered on Saturday in the nation's capital. The APC and Mr. Edwo had filed the suit alleging that Governor Obaseki presented a forged certificate to seek re election in the Edo State governorship election election held on September 19, 2020. In his reaction to the court verdict, Governor Obaseki said the judgment is a triumph of the rule of law and a testament to the fact that truth would prevail ultimately, no matter how vehemently detractors push lies in the face of immense evidence. The governor added that the verdict has confirmed once again that Edo people were well guided in trusting him to lead them in the September 19th governorship election. Meanwhile, global human rights organization Amnesty International has condemned the arrest of the convener of the Revolution Now movement, Omoya Leshore, and four others over allegations of unlawful assembly and criminal conspiracy. In a series of tweets on Saturday, it called for the immediate release of the activists and demanded that the charges against them be dropped. The group said Shore and others were unlawfully arrested on Friday last week for peacefully exercising their rights to freedom of assembly and expression. On the international scene, an Indonesian budget airline plane with 62 people on board is suspected to have crashed into the sea shortly after the Boeing 737 took off from Jakarta Airport on Saturday. Flight tracking data showed the Sriwijaya Air Boeing 737-500 plunged into a steep dive about four minutes after takeoff. And in sports, Spain's heaviest snowfall in decades has forced Atletico Madrid's game against Athletic Bilbao on Saturday to be postponed. The blizzards have caused chaos in Spain, with the capital's airport closed, hundreds of motorists stranded and more snow forecast for Saturday. And that's the evening news recap. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for fresh updates. I'm Tenio Lash Thanks for watching.